Hey everyone, Zero Jetty here with the XBLA Fans Channel. Here you go, quick taste of Reflection of Mine, a game coded as being a very, very hard puzzle game. Uh, it does live up to that, but not in the best way. Uh, I'm not the biggest fan of like sort of puzzle games and stuff like that, but I, I can usually get my way through them. If you look at the other videos, uh, of course, most of the times it's kind of funny how I do fine, and then when I start making the level uh, video, it uh, kind of goes south for me. Uh, but the issue with this one is that this game, it'll show you a concept, and then immediately the next level takes that concept to the hardest extreme, not really giving you time to kind of adjust to that concept and play a few levels with it. Uh, these first few levels here actually did pretty fine, kind of like slowly taking you through it, but then all of a sudden it just goes crazy hard to a point where it's like, oh, well, I can't make any progress without using the hint system. It's kind of frustrating, but I'm going to, I'm going to kind of show you what I mean here. So, uh, as you can see, I'm controlling two characters here, uh, using the, uh, directional pad or uh, analog stick allows you to, um, move around and stuff like that. And, uh, they both move. Uh, if you look at the bottom left, I got my hint system. If I hit Y, uh, it'll actually show me the answer or at least the answer up to the next like checkpoint. And I can like rewind time, which I've never used. Uh, but as you can see uh, in this level, these sort of traps, when I step on them with the girl on the right, the traps on the girl on the left activate and uh, vice versa. Uh, but the entire story behind this is it's a girl with split personality. Uh, and we are at a psychiatrist trying to figure out which is the real quote unquote personality. But anyways. All right. So let's see. All right, so that doesn't work out there. And so I have finished this, so let's see. All right, cool. There we go. So that was pretty simple, right? And then we get this like kind of little cutscene here with like her talking to someone. But yeah, it's very much based around like the kind of split personality thing. And then we get this. Like, I feel that this is a way too extreme jump. Uh, if you ask me. So let's see here. Nope, dead. All right, let's see. So what can I actually do here? Can't go down. Can I go up? Nope. Can't go left. I can go left again. That's fine. Go up. So she's stuck on the left there. Nope. I went too far up. Nope. I wasn't paying attention to the uh, right. And uh, the steps at the top uh, allow you to, like, it's how many, like, steps you've actually taken. Oh, I want to actually do this. Forgot. And then we're going to go up. Up again. See. So if I go that way, I can't really go up because of those spikes there. But can I just go? No, I've kind of. I've kind of messed myself up there, but you, you get what I'm saying, right? It's like the difficulty jumps kind of extreme, like especially with how big this level is. I'm going to go ahead and use the uh, tip system. Go down. And some of the like required movements to do this is kind of like crazy. Like how many, nope, and I'm dead. Uh, the, uh, like the required, uh, the required, uh, nope, the required path and stuff, like, just feel like it's way, way, way too long. Like, the difficulty sounds like it's not coming from, oh, it's like, like, you makes you think and stuff like that. It's just that there's way too much going on. All right, so there's a checkpoint there. Nope. 
so she can't go up or and she can't move anywhere there and she can't do anything there it's just kind of frustrating yeah yeah whatever to use the hint system so I can actually show you how it kind of works uh, to actually have to get it back. It's a weird little mini game you have to play. Like this feels like it should be a level like maybe 10 levels from now. Mm-hmm. Up. And there we go. It's like, look how big this level is. We're just going to kind of just uh, brute force this and see if we can't uh, see what the next level's like. It's like, you, so you have to loop all the way back through the level just to make it out of here. I find that insane. Nope, and I'm dead, and I wasted my thing. So I don't even remember what I had to do, because, of, like, look at the non... Like, it leaves tracks, but look at the nonsense it leaves. Um, I literally don't know anymore. I'll just go ahead and, uh... I think if you die three times... There we go. And then you go to this uh, little world to get more hints. But like, I, I hope you understand what I'm like saying about like the ridiculous hike and like difficulty. It's not fun. Uh, I like I keep bringing it up whenever I make videos like these. Uh, Super Meat Boy does that difficulty in a really fun way, uh, and it's not like oh, look at this crazy long level that I have to complete. It's oh, let's look at this. Uh, like quick series of jumps and like interesting looking level. Uh, hold on. There we go. Also, if you fail this, you are, if you get hurt here, you actually have to start all the way from the beginning again. I just, I just don't think that the massive difficulty spike is needed at all. Like those levels should be there. But why are they like the second level after introducing a concept? It's like saying your game is hard because you can't use the like the uh, button configuration. Like my game is hard, but that's because you've mapped the jump button to pressing uh, on the uh, analog stick and won't allow it to be remapped. It's like, ha ha ha, my game's hard, but it's because I've specifically made it to kind of be jerkish. Or I don't know how to actually make it uh, a gradual increase in difficulty. Nope. And I totally didn't hit that. We're just going to hit this thing and get out of here. And we'll see what the next level is like. Uh, the easier difficulty actually allows you to destroy objectives, but... You can't, like, complete it, but... I don't think I'll be coming back to this game. It's like I'm literally all the way back at the beginning of the level. And I went too fast. Awesome. Now I have to wait for that to finish. Nope. Like, it's a perfect way to be like, oh, this level's too difficult. Out of nowhere, I'm not enjoying this, so I'm just going to go play something else that I enjoy. And I'm someone who loves the Dark Souls games. I already did it. Ooh, another one. Hmm. 
Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, chapter two is not available. It's like, look at this. I'm guessing at some point, like, let's actually go back and let's go back the hotel. Let's see what this is all about. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right, that's weird. Sure, why not? Okay. Mm-hmm. All right, let's just kind of... Oh, so it's just another personality thing. It's like this. This is this is a like now we have locks, so we'll introduce this slowly. Uh, hold on, we'll figure this out. No, it's not gonna work. There we go. Nope, I wasn't paying attention. Do I still have the key though? No, I do not. Like that's oh. Not paying attention. Like this one is like I, that one. I literally was not paying attention. Uh, this very much feels like, hey, this is a new concept. We're gonna we're gonna let you get used to it, and hopefully, it won't. Oops, it won't go crazy on the next level of it. Like again, that's my biggest issue is like the jump from, hey, we're just gonna we're just gonna go from. Zero to a hundred. I need to keep an eye on the right side more. Nope. I need to slow down. All right, oh, we got this one. We'll finish this level and then we'll wrap it up. Down, down. There he goes. Got it. We'll just skip that for now. I like this one. This is slightly better again. I don't know what was with that one level, but I'm hoping that that pattern doesn't repeat again. But having that sort of blockade that early into your game, it's just like, no. So maybe this does get better. Maybe they don't keep doing... I like how there's a checkpoint right here. Maybe they don't keep doing that over and over again. Hope, hope they don't. I'm Zero JD. This is the XBLA Fans channel. Like I said before, that really early roadblock of that a zero to a hundred is infuriating, to be honest. Anyways, see ya.